I've seen you in a movie. I heard you in a song. Now I know that this will never go wrong. Like you. What's up, everyone? It's Mary Dominique. Welcome to my channel. I'm so excited today. If you are a new follower of mine, I do these Walmart hauls pretty much every season. As you saw from the title, this is going to be my spring haul. I'm really excited about the pieces that I found for this haul. I went in store for everything. I got things from the men's section, women's section, plus section, and we're just gonna jack it all up and style it for you. I think I have like 12 outfits. Sorry about my voice, it's a little measly. I have allergies. Comment below if you're with me on that. Let's get right into the video. I first wanna get into all the accessories and shoes that I found. I will leave some timestamps if you wanna skip over this part, but if you're an accessories kind of person, I found the best things. The shoes were amazing at Walmart this time. I actually had a really hard time narrowing it down because there were so many good ones. I first found these little sneakers. They're so amazing. They also came in black. They're very true to size. They are no boundaries. I got a size seven in these and they fit great. There's memory foam and I think they're like a dupe for a Converse, especially if you look at the black ones. Next up are these sandals. How awesome are these? First of all, they're really comfortable. These are also no boundaries, but what I love about these is the square top. I just think it's such a vibe right now. I also picked them up in black. These are gonna be such a staple for me for spring and summer. I'll leave all links for all the items in my description box, so check that out. For a 90s kid like me, you remember shoes like these. These are so fun, I love them so much. They're black leather with the cute buckle decal. I wore these in a few outfits. Then I also got three hats. I got two terry cloth bucket hats. They also came in two other colors. These are so good because they're not too deep of a bucket hat and they fit my head really well. They're kind of square and I love them. You'll see these in the video. They fit perfectly. I picked up this really beautiful hat. I'm actually going to Georgia soon and I just felt like this would be perfect for Georgia. It came with another scarf that you can swap out so I could use um, dark blue as well. And then I also saw they came in like four other colors. So this is a great staple to have for spring and summer. Very cottage core. For bags, I have two for y'all. I have this cute little black one. It's so Y2K, kind of 90s vibes. Love the shape of this. And it looks so luxe and more expensive because it has this little chain detail, which I also love. I just think it's a great quality. There's a zipper, you can fit a decent amount. I also picked up this really fun, camo bag. I just love the beigey muted neutral tones and it comes with a crossbody strap. Kind of want to zoom in on this one. This belt you're going to see in the video a million times. This is the belt. It is actually reversible so you can just pull it down and switch it and then it's black. I love this versatile belt. It's very Y2K 90s also. It reminds me of like mud. All those outfits that we used to wear back in the day. If you grew up with that. And I just absolutely adore that you can switch it from white to black. So this was a must have. I also picked up these men's crew socks, which I'll leave. They're really nice to have. They're a little taller so they can fit with boots and stuff. Doc Martens, you can use them with sneakers, kind of slouch them down, get like that slouchy sock look. I just needed a pack of these and they were really affordable. So I'll leave links to that too. But that concludes the accessories. Again, I'm gonna link everything in the description box. So let's jump right into the outfits. For this first outfit, absolutely had to start with this outfit because I'm really excited about this new trend. And if you are on Instagram a lot, you've probably already seen it, but it is the Dickies work pants. I picked them up in two colors. I got black and then I also got the classic tan, which is how I styled it for you in the video today. These are such a gem. I'll insert some pictures of how I styled it for Instagram, but they have this cool white band on the inside that says Dickies, it's the original 874 work pants, has the little Dickies logo on it, it's so funny that this is coming back in style, but basically I just sized up and then I put them all the way on, zipped them up and folded it over and it gives you this white felt look and as you guys know cargos are really in too, so I just wanted to definitely style these for you guys. I'm size 27 in women's pants and usually a 32 in men's or sometimes a 30, it depends. But for these, I went all the way up to a 34, and the length on these is a 30 because I wanted to wear them with sneakers. So I got a 34, 30, and I'm 5'1 for reference. I styled it with this really cute new seamless bralette that No Boundaries has. 
It is so comfortable. It's got a ribbed detail, which I love. I'm gonna take the padding out just because I always take the padding out. I styled it with that. I feel like a crop or like a corset. Of course, Walmart didn't have any corsets, but a corset style with this is perfect. That's how I style it for Instagram. And then I just wore white sneakers. I'm also going to link this top. I love it so much. It's time and true. It's just a white button down. I feel like everyone needs one. This is women, so it was nice because it kind of scoops down at the bottom, which I'm really picky about with button downs. I don't like when they're super straight at the bottom, so this one cuffs. And then I got a large in this to have it a little oversized and have it be versatile for a couple different styles I want to try. I just went with the black bag and I think this outfit looks so cute and it's complete. But definitely get your hands on the Dickies pants. I'll leave a link for those. They are so cute. Festival season, country music festivals, all of that. That season is upon us, as you guys know, so I want to try to style something from Walmart using all Walmart pieces. This next fit is really fun. I used a men's shirt. I just thought it was so California vibes. I think this is really fun for like, especially like a country concert. I actually went with an extra small. I wanted it to be as small and as tight as possible. And I tucked it into these shorts. So I got these time and true shorts. They are really comfortable. I could have went with a size down. I got a 10 because they didn't have an E. Uh, I could have ordered it online, but I was running out of time. So these are definitely oversized. But what I did was I just took the white belt and cinched it as tight as I possibly could. And I actually found that it was nice because there was a lot of coverage in the booty. If you want, you could always size up in these. They are really stretchy. I like the details on these. They're just ripped at the bottom, super fun, perfect for festival season. And then I'm wearing my Princess Polly boots. If you have any Western boots that will work or anything will work with this, honestly, sneakers. But I just thought it was a really fun festival look. I'll link the boots as well just because they're shook. I kind of freaked out when I saw this dress because it's such a huge trend. And the fact that Walmart had it in my favorite material that Walmart has. All right, guys. So it's basically just a button down shirt dress but it has that rouging and it's super flattering. This was $12.98. I just styled it here with another pair of Western boots. I just thought pairing it with a simple boot just really elevated the look. And you can wear it with fun sunglasses. You could do like a fringe bag or like I have it here with the little black bag, but it's really comfortable. I got a small in this and it was very form fitting and just fit in all the right places. I highly recommend this dress. I think it came in blue, red, and brown as well. I honestly wanted all of them, but I was like, let me get home and try this on. I'm gonna have to get the rest of the colors because it's so good. Just a simple, cute, one and done kind of fit. Call me crazy, but I'm taking this cargo trend full send because I saw Walmart had a Lee cargo skirt. How cute is this, guys? It actually literally has a cargo pocket on the side, giving me such nostalgia. I love the pockets in the back, and then it has this very comfortable waistband. It's a regular fit. It's actually a skirt, which makes it even better, and it has this lining inside. Ultra soft waistband, very comfortable. It is a mid-rise, but honestly, it went pretty high up on me, and then the length was really great. Also, it covers your entire booty, which again, really important. I styled that here with this kimono that I'm wearing. This is so luxe for Walmart to have. I'm absolutely into this. I have to show you a close-up. It's kind of got a waffle print material here. For this skirt, I got a size 6 and it fit perfectly. I probably could have sized down in this as well, but sometimes I just go a size bigger to be super comfortable. I paired it with this No Boundaries marble tank top. It is so fun. And if you've watched my other videos, I try to grab one of these every time they come out with a new color. This one's really beautiful. It's like peachy, kind of muted tones. And I got a small in this as well with a terry cloth bucket hat and the white sneaks. Perfect, perfect outfit. This is for all my cool girls, a little streetwear in this next outfit. I grabbed a really cool top from the men's section that I plan on wearing a bunch of ways as well. It's just like that other top, but for this one, I actually grabbed a large. I'm using it as a little overcoat. I love the newspaper details. There are palm trees on it. The colors are just really cool. I'm going, like I said, full send with the cargo trend. I found these shorts. So these are just black cargo shorts. I'm so here for them. Guys, these honestly fit very, very comfortably. They have a stretch waistband as well. They are 100% cotton, so I sized up on these as well. Instead of the six, I just went for the eight, so they were really casual, comfortable. 
For $15, you can't beat it. I paired it with this black tank top. I love this material. This is from No Boundaries. It's just a really comfortable material. I got this in a size small. I'm actually also wearing this sage color as well. They came in separate. So the small fit perfectly, and this tank top's gonna be used for a ton of outfits. Can't go wrong with a tank top like this. And I specifically love the cut of this, how high it comes. These are really flattering. Just paired it here with the black side of the belt and the little white sneakers and you are ready for the day. You know when you see an item at the store and you don't even hesitate, you're like, yep, that's coming home with me? That's how I feel about these pants, honestly. They are, to me, like the star of the show. They're gonna be loud and probably crazy for some of you. So I got these in the men's section and they are Conspiracy by West. I'm probably saying that wrong, but it's a brand that is offered at Walmart in store. They probably have them online as well. I'll link them. How fun is this pattern? Just giving me Miami, California, just Lana Del Rey. I love them. I went and paired it with that black tank and then I just wanted to really jazz it up. You can dress this up or dress this down. I think the pants kind of do it all. But here I went with a glittery bag from Windsor. I believe it's sold out, but any glittery bag will work. And then just these glittery shoes as well. This outfit would be perfect for a night on the town when you want to look cute, but just not uncomfortable, honestly. These photograph really well. I can't wait to take them out and about. Trousers and work pants are really on the horizon for spring and summer, so I definitely wanted to grab a pair. I actually went over to the men's section and grabbed a pair of the George work pants. I will definitely be linking these. I got a 30-30 in these because they were the four-way stretch, really comfortable. I styled them with the black tank top again. I went with those really cool chunky shoes to match the belt, the black bag. It's simple, definitely clean girl aesthetic. If you don't know what that is, just kind of like minimal style, casual style, Pinterest vibes. The men's pants really surprised me. I loved the length. Again, 30-30 because I wanted to wear it with some flat shoes. Minty pastels are definitely gonna be all the rage in spring. As we know, they're always a hit for spring. So I wanted to show you just a cute, easy pastel outfit. So here we have this sage tank top that I'm wearing with the jean shorts I already showed you guys. And then I went with the minty green flops and the minty green terry cloth hat. I just think it's a simple, cute, easy look. Yeah, and I can see this for errands or going to meet some friends for lunch. This is what I mean, like the hat just fits so good. I have like a smaller face and head, so bucket hats can be overwhelming on my face sometimes, so I'm really glad that this worked out so well. The bathing suit section at Walmart was absolutely unreal. It was almost like a whole nother realm I didn't even have time to get into, but I did find this bathing suit cover up, and I can tell you that it would be flattering on almost anyone. It is so beautiful. It's made of rayon and polyester, but it's a linen type material. It has a little collar, kind of V's down, but what I really love about it is at the bottom it kind of scoops up and it makes it very flattering. There's a tie on the inside just like a robe would have and then it ties on the outer hip. So it's just very flattering because you can adjust it and make it tighter or smaller. This came in black as well, which I'm 100% gonna go grab. I think it was $20, so it was well worth it for a classic beach cover-up. I got this in a small and it fit really well. I just kind of wore it with a white bralette in this and then the white hat just to show you how that looked. But I have to say, this is one of my favorite finds from the video. Matching sets are definitely all the rage right now, so I wanted to definitely make sure I grabbed a matching set for you guys. And also, I, of course was checking out the Avia section. That is the athletic section in Walmart. They have such good athletic wear, I must say. I found, I, I'm just so happy about this. I found the cutest little camo set. These shorts were I think $6 or $5, $5.98. And then the top was $20. Less than $30, you're getting this really cute set. It has pockets here. The zipper has this little ring detail. I got a medium in this, just so it was a tiny bit oversized. And I also got a medium in the shorts, could have got a small, but honestly, like I said, I always typically grab a medium anyway. These are super lightweight, they have wicking to them. They're just a really cute athletic short. Probably not for like any really intense workout, but for walking, walks on the block. Comes with pockets as well. I think my favorite part is that they're just so lightweight. And they do come down far enough that, again, your butt's not hanging out. That's huge for me. I always love finding outfits at Walmart that I can style for going out nights. Just because it is like a little bit 
harder. They definitely are more on the casual side. I wanted to show off these really cool Wrangler pants. So they have this little cargo pocket on the side. I've been seeing girls like roll them over, so if you want to size up, you can do that. This is a very relaxed fit. I was lucky to find these in store. They're selling like hotcakes. So I did get a 32, 32 in these. I styled it here with a pair of boots. They're just a simple black boot, any will work. And then I used that newspaper top. What I did was I first had it off the shoulder and then I tied it so that it would be like a little bit slouchy. Again, I grabbed a large in that. So I just thought that was a really cool way to elevate that shirt and make it more fun for going out. The belt and the black bag, just again, very cool streetwear vibes. Could definitely see myself going out in this. I think it's really fun. You could also dress the cargos down, which I will show you how I did that in a second. But again, I've seen girls do so many fun things with these cargo pants. It's such a vibe right now. The second way I styled the cargos was with this little no boundaries. I think it's just like a little cardigan, honestly. I got a size small in this. And when I put it on, I was like, wait a second, I'm going to wear this as a shirt. But you can definitely wear it open with a cami or something like that. I loved how it fit here. So I just went with the inverted, the white side of the belt, the cargos, and some converse. I could see myself wearing this to like a festival, maybe even like a local event that's going around downtown, brewery, something like that. One of my all-time favorite things to wear is just a large, solid colored shirt. I just have a thing for that. I always am doing that. So if you've watched my videos before, you've seen me style these a couple ways. This time I went with this really beautiful orange shade. This is a no boundaries shirt. It is scooped at the bottom. This is a men's top. I love the color. I got a large in this just to wear it as a dress. It's definitely, of course, on the more risque kind of side with the scoop. You can wear shorts with this or you can wear leggings, something like that, just to be a little more covered. But here I just went with the white belt and I think it came out so fun. I wanted to wear something really unique with these, so I grabbed my new Simi shoes. These are just like a big platform shoe. I mean, ankle breakers for sure, but if you like tie up shoes, these are amazing because they're just flat, so I'm really into these. I'll link those as well. And a white bag. This white bag is from like Shein. I feel like I could see it for like a sunset dinner. Casual, fun, cute, and honestly the best part about it is it's easy. The shirt is obviously very versatile, so I wanted to show you another way I wore it here. So I just tied it in the front like a normal knot, and then I wore it with these Secret Treasures shorts. Guys, I'm absolutely in love with these shorts. I always like to go over to the sleepwear section and see what they have. This beigey color is absolutely stunning. I got a size small in these and they're just like a long comfortable short with pockets. They have a raw hem. The material is so soft and nice. It could go with a lot of the tops like this top, the black top. A lot of the things I bought in this video this would go perfect with. So I paired it with the pastel green flip flops and then just like a little green bag with palm trees just to kind of like make everything go together. It's just a really fun, easy look I wanted to show you. Actually on the final look, the final outfit, again, you can mix and match so many of these items. I wanted to pick a lot of fun basics for you guys. You kind of know the drill if you see my videos, but this top is so good. Come on, the colors. These colors are gonna be really huge in the spring. More saturated colors like neons, things like this. I wanted to show you how I wear it as a dress. So I went ahead and took the white belt again and just kind of like loosened the top, like pulled it up and over and made it slouchy and scrunchy. I wore that glittery bag and glittery shoes again just to spruce it up and add a little bit of glitter. It's kind of fun taking something so casual and just dressing it up with some glittery and diamondy items. I feel like it just elevates a look very quickly. Just double check that is everything for the video. I had such a good time. This time I literally was at every Walmart that I had in my location just seeing what were the best items that I personally would like to style and make outfits for you guys. So these are my top favorites. Again, I will link everything in the description box. If I forgot anything, sizes, anything, just let me know, comment, and I will get back to you as soon as possible. I had such a good time doing this video. It would mean so much to me. Like and subscribe to this video, and I will see you in my next haul.